We're just a couple days away from the first day of fall, and the weather is changing right on cue. Yeah, temperatures will be plunging quickly by 30 degrees over the next few days. So that got us wondering, can a sudden change in temperature make us sick? Susan Elizabeth Littlefield has the answer to tonight's good question. As the sun sets on summer 2022, some are holding on tight. I've been on a walk now for almost two hours. You're really soaking it up. Yeah, I am. I'm trying to uh, just enjoy the sun. Others are happy the sun is setting on this season. I actually like it when it's a little bit cooler. I don't like to sweat, and obviously I'm sweating like a madman right now because it's so warm. So. Well, but. you won't be tomorrow. That's good to hear. That's good to hear. I'm looking forward to it. Sweat be gone because in Minnesota, fall is a sharp descent. Temps will plummet by about 30 degrees in the next few days. And that plunge can be tough mentally. When it gets cold, all I want to do is eat like bread and bad food. And physically, too. Some people complain of cold symptoms, headaches, and feeling off kilter. I know it's going to get rather cold pretty darn quickly. Dr. Matthews is a seasoned Minnesotan and a seasoned physician. Can these abrupt weather changes affect our health? Good question. Generally, yes. But it's not the way you think it is. It's not the cold weather directly impacting. He says it's that viruses and bacteria thrive in cold and dry air. They don't break down at all. And they also build this protective shell around them that helps them travel through the air longer and longer. So viruses love it. And he says the cold affects our mucus and makes us more likely to trap bacteria. And we get trapped inside, which makes us more likely to spread sickness. People with chronic conditions, he said, get hit the worst, but anyone can feel off. So early on, we may start feeling, oh, I don't feel right, because you're working in a different environment altogether. There are only a few studies on acute temp changes. This one concludes saying a decrease in temps increases the chance of getting a cold, and that more colds happen when it's below freezing. Some of this is based in science. Some of this is a little bit of how our body reacts to some things. Because we know the change is coming. That's right. Susan Elizabeth Littlefield. And I welcome it. You welcome it. I love it. You're a fall guy. WCCO for news. Dr. Matthew says the best way to beat getting sick is to keep up with those summer habits of exercise, eating well, and socializing.